Hey, Solana and Prosper, this is Dr. Rouse here. I am coming to you uh, from the office today. We are, um, we finished up a little bit early, so I am here doing some videos. Uh, not from the truck today, so that's great. Um, it changes scenery. We got the owl behind us. We got the prize wall with all the cool toys for the kids. Uh, September 1st um, is when we're planning on starting to hand those out and stuff, uh, unless anything changes with the governor. Um, right now they're for show, but we can't wait to start using them. So uh, please book and try to get the kiddos in. Today we are talking about phase one treatment. I know this is probably going to be something maybe one of your friends has had a kid that's gone through, um, but phase one treatment is super crucial to saving time and money down the road with braces. So most important things that you should look for are these nine things in the middle. I put arrows towards the things that are the most common problems that I see. Uh, we typically give you one of these, uh, a paper copy, and then we'll take a look at your kiddo together and find out, um, you know, which, you know, which one of these, if any of them, apply to um, your little one, and then we figure out uh, how quickly we can solve that problem or remedy that problem. The reason is uh, because the bones of the face really form quickly by about the age of nine or 10. So if I see a nine-year-old and they've already got one of these uh, things going on, it is really a race against time um, to, try, to try to correct those. And the sooner we can get to it, the sooner um, that we can really have the, your little one in and out and not have to worry so much about later on um, additional, like years and years. Like as a kid, you know, I had friends that went through braces three times or they went through it for five or six years and you, it shouldn't be, it shouldn't be happening. So um, uh, the Academy of Orthodontics really recommends that there's a consultation by age seven. We have something called the seven up club uh, for kids. It's the seven up kids club. And um, basically your kid comes in, they get a t-shirt. Uh, we go over, you know, how many teeth they've lost, how many teeth they've got left, um, any of this kind of stuff. And then we really try to build a rapport with you and your family so that you feel like um, you are well-educated on what's going on with your child and what we're looking for um, in terms of treatment uh, objectives and what we're trying to get out of that so that your kid doesn't have to deal with an open bite or they don't have to deal with... Um, you know, uh, an open bite, overbite, um, and a cross bites and all kinds of stuff. So please uh, uh, take a look at this slide as well and, and see that sometimes it comes from bad habits, right? So sometimes we will start with a thumb sucking appliance or something that there are options out there to help because every time that I see somebody who tries to do it on their own, uh, maybe the kid will stop for a week or two and then they come back in and, and they're right back at it. So. Our first goal is usually to stop those nasty habits, um, and sometimes they they die hard, uh, and sometimes you know it really is is fixed pretty quickly. Um, our job is is that when we start phase one, we don't have um, the kiddo go back to thumb sucking or or finger sucking or doing anything that they're not supposed to be doing uh, because it's not good for the mouth. It basically causes a lot of different problems. So we'll talk about that later. Again, I'm trying to keep these videos short. Um, if you don't get to it on time, the number one thing that I want you to think about is, is that uh, this sometimes requires surgery later on in life to fix. So if you have that look on the left is what I'm seeing here. Um, sometimes they'll have to do jaw surgery. If you have that Jay Leno look um, where you're, you know, you have a severe underbite, sometimes they'll have to do surgery for that as well. So our whole goal is why could this not have been prevented as a kid? And a lot of times it can. So um, if everything is uh, uh, tracking well, um, then sometimes they can be in and out in um, about nine months. So um, we'll talk to you all about that. Uh, the, that last line right there is for aligners, but it's about nine months for phase one treatment. And sometimes that can literally save you years down the road. Um, I have seen kids who didn't even require a phase two of braces because uh, their phase one went so successful and everything else dropped in. Um, so there's that thumb sucking appliance that I was talking about on the right. And then on the left, if you want to, you could always freeze this. 
video and then take a look over there on the left pan picture at what happens to the roof of the mouth. It gets pushed up, the tongue gets a lot stronger, a lot stronger than it really should be by pushing out teeth and causing that gap in between the teeth. So usually that gap in between the teeth is from the thumb or the tongue. Um, and then I uh, just want to let you know that we are doing uh, free orthodontic consultations. Um, and then, you know, once we go ahead and start treatment and stuff, we can, we can work it out financially. We can figure it out in terms of the treatment objectives. And we offer ceramic braces, uh, which are just clear. Um, we offer, of course, traditional metal braces uh, for kids, and we can discuss the differences between those. And we offer our boss aligners. So we have multiple options out there. Again, if you're a cash patient, you're, how can I get braces? That's what we're here for. Uh, clear aligners we're doing is a thousand dollars off right now and also wanted to let y'all know we have a Facebook uh, live coming up with the mayor on the 10th of September so depending on when you're watching this video it should be coming up sometime soon and we look forward to having you guys tune in then and uh, take care have a great day and uh, give us a call if you need anything 972-885-9670 look forward to hearing from you soon take care salon and prosper bye, -bye.